It's a woodpecker, I think. Yeah. What are they called in Spanish? Corre camino? No. Un pájaro carpintero. Do a little bit of vlogging. We are at Paso Picacho. Vlogging with the 11 1.8. And I'm shooting some pictures. And I hope you can see a good image of what we're seeing. So it's um, sunny, but it's been cloudy off and on. I love the clouds. You can see the lake. Yeah, I don't know if the lens could see it, but we can see it. So I love these areas. <clears throat> This is up in, I believe, Rancho Cuyamaca area. So Lake Cuyamaca, if you can't see it from here, it's straight over there, down where the valley, a little bit of past that little hill. That's where the lake is at. And for my birthday, my girlfriend suggested doing something, and this was my first um, thing that came to mind to spend the weekend here. So we got lucky and I was able to find a cabin kind of last minute, literally the day before, the night before. And um, that was really cool. So we were we come Vanessa and I, Chapo and Kiki, which I guess you all, you all already met, and um, Vanessa's parents and grandma. So it's been a pleasant, a pleasant time so far enjoying the outdoors and now enjoying the like taking some pictures and a little bit of vlogging now I won't be able to post this because I don't have to go back to the Mac you turn of the Mac back to the Mac okay maybe that was whack but oh this is cool right here to be able to get the um, The, oh my god the images so I can put and put it on the uh, put it on YouTube <clears throat> the only thing that has been different now is that I've made some YouTube I'm sorry some videos before and oh. I haven't posted them because I haven't edited them edit them edit them edit edit them yeah something like that yeah, it okay, she so approves. Difference if I say it. Makes a difference, babe. <clears throat> and so what I'm doing now, I'm not editing. I'm just literally just grabbing the videos and posting them as cool or as whack as you think they are. I think they're dope. Yeah, so that's why I'm being I've been able to post them because I don't edit them. Edit them. Edit them. And I just post them. But because I have cool images and cool pictures, maybe I should just do that. So I'm gonna try to go back and maybe just uh, not edit them because I do have a lot of cool trips that Vanessa and I have made that I think would be cool to share. Plus, just to have cool memories. I like seeing the birds. The birds are so pretty. Yeah. <clears throat> what is it? The Hulk? The, the bird. Is it doing the little holes on the tree? Like yeah. It's in action? Yeah. Oh yeah, that is, that's the... Si, ese son... Okay, I don't know much about birds. But that's... A woodpecker? <laughs> Pájaro carpintero. Oh, oh! Did you guys see that in action? He didn't like me calling him that, I'm sorry. You and I both. I think I caught that. Uh, I think I caught part of that in on camera. I saw it like hit branches and then quickly turn the camera towards it. All right. So these are pretty tall pine trees. Have you ever heard of 
I think it's called Redwood Redwoods, the Redwoods. And they say the trees they are ginormous, but so like big, like these trees are like huge. And they are um, big enough for them to like build a tunnel through a tree. We should go and see them. That's another That's trip. In, um... Northern California. I don't know the oh that's a cool tree. Careful baby these these woodpeckers are dropping bombs. Yeah, I'm a little bit scared now. Okay babe, well did you bring your helmet? No. Well babe. You know what I mean? What can I say? And this is where they perform some rituals that not too many get to see. This is at night. No, I'm just kidding, but it, what, they could make a movie out of that, for sure. Alright, people, come on. This is the worst for nature. So let's put it away where it belongs. So as you can see, it kind of gets cloudy. And um, I predict, by my own predictions, that it's gonna snow tonight. What was that about? Because Siri told me. You know what, babe? That's a good guess. That's a very good guess. All right, and right now, we're going towards... So we found the cabin last night. It was kind of, we got here after hours, so it was dark. So when you come to these places, you can't tell. You can barely see the numbers there. You can barely see numbers. You can barely see... Um, you can barely see, um, you know, there's not much notifying you or signs telling you where you're at nighttime animals when the sun sets in the west this area begins to come alive animals that have been sleeping in the hiding and hiding during the day begin looking for food I tell you babe most are specially adapted to hunt prey and protect themselves at night bats use a type of sonar called echolocation to locate the food. Possums, oh yeah, for sure possums are there. All right, so we saw we saw a deer, remember? The first night, yeah, well, or last yeah. night actually. Cool bobcats, okay, we don't want to run into any of those. The great horned owl will be cool to see. And as you can see, we're coming to the Azalea, Azalea, Azalea. Asalea Glen Trail. Trail. You know what, babe? I like the way you think. We're on the trail, baby. We're on the trail. <clears throat> well, it's a bunch of them right there. See them? Yeah, protect your head. Okay. So I'm going to stop the camera because I'm going to start taking some pictures now. <laughs> 